All right, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the Rideshare Hub. My name is Dylan, and today I am with my friend. Hi, I'm Fiona. Fiona, so today we're just gonna be talking, she's gonna be on the channel from time to time, and she is an Uber and a Lyft expert, right? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah no. definitely. She, she takes Uber and Lyft every once in a while, and um, or quite a bit, and um, we're just gonna be talking, and she's gonna be on the channel from time to time, and today I'm just gonna ask her a few questions on what she thinks about Uber and Lyft, and yeah, then we can all talk about it together. Okay, so can you just introduce yourself? Yeah, so I'm Fiona, and I am a junior here at UC Berkeley. Um, hey, don't don't tell them where we go. Oh, uh, just kidding. Wait, what, so what are we talking about? <laughs> I'm just kidding, it's fine. Um, I'm Fiona, and I'm a blogger, and I take Uber and Lyft occasionally over to San Francisco a lot. Um, so, yeah, that's kind of my... So interesting. Thank you for sharing your <laughs> life. You have the most interesting life ever. Okay, so uh, I have some questions for you. Okay. All right. So, how often do you take Uber and Lyft? Like every week. Every which single is, week. Yeah, which is pretty pretty bad. Okay, and where, like where do you usually go? Um, I'll usually go over to Alameda or like Oakland. Um, wait, don't tell them like the locations. <laughs> Just say like. <laughs> oh, I usually wait, go wait, around wait. the Bay Area. You know, that's kind of <laughs> okay. kind of where I hang out. You know, <laughs> keep it local. We don't we don't go too far just because that that gets expensive. Yeah, don't we're not telling you guys where exactly we go. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, and That's um, <laughs> all right. So, just right off the bat, what's one thing you like about Uber? Wait, do you take Uber and Lyft, or just what are the I other? I take both. Okay, so what's yeah. one thing you like about Uber and Lyft? Um, I like Uber wait, wait, because hold on. <laughs> there's a helicopter. That's and, a plane. Or there's a plane. No, nope. it's um, it's um, yeah, it's a plane, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice try. <laughs> All right, so just right off the bat, what is one thing you like about Uber and Lyft? Um, I like Uber because it's convenient. That's usually my first choice. I don't know why. I think I just like the app like layout better. And then for Lyft, I usually like Lyft better just because everyone's a lot nicer. I don't really have a lot of. You think the drivers are nicer on Lyft? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Um. Interesting. And. It is way cheaper than Uber, but sometimes I like Uber because they pick me up faster. So yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah. it's a hit or miss. It's yeah. Well, okay. Well, um, you kind of jumped the gun. I was mainly asking like, what do you like in general about the service? Oh. But that's fine as well. Like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. You're fine. You're fine. I'll just leave all that in. Okay. Um, what I like about the service? Yeah. Like, do you like that it's cheap that it's easy that it's um, convenient what like what what's the reason you choose uber and lyft okay i like uber just because it's a lot more convenient for me personally I think like just, what would like, you rather what would you otherwise take like before they're invented like the bus or <laughs> what would, like you know you what know, i mean i was just thinking about that the other day i literally don't know what life would be like before uber or lyft <laughs> like honestly like i, mean, I have like, no it, idea they like, haven't I think been I'd around be that totally long. screwed i think i would be walking around like everywhere yeah i've literally walked across town before yeah. um to get where i needed to go but i guess i would have to learn how to take the bus yeah or get a ride i don't know hitchhike hitchhike yeah, yeah that's kind of that's kind of the spiel because I, I, I don't know though. what I like, would have done, honestly. What would life be like without Uber and Lyft? Yeah, really though. Maybe that could be another segment. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and now what's one thing you don't like about Uber and Lyft? I don't like Uber sometimes because they're, they're a little mean and a little aggressive sometimes. The drivers? Yeah. Like, how? Sometimes they're just like really grumpy. Like, I think they just okay. like... Like, I don't think it's anyone's fault. I think sometimes they just work, like, a lot over the day, and they just, like, yeah. they're kind of over it. Or maybe they have, like, a bad rider before that. Yeah. Um, but Lyft riders, or Lyft drivers, usually I have, like, a good experience with. They're really cool. I um, think that, like, a lot of Lyft drivers, like, they just do it very part-time. Yeah. And, like, Uber drivers do it... Full-time. Mostly full-time. Yeah. Um, yeah. But I also like Lyft because it's, um... Well, wait, we're doing reasons why I don't like it, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, Lyft takes a little longer than Uber does. When well, I this do is also like just in general, like. <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, but like yeah, it's yeah, just yeah. like some some Sometimes it takes are too like long. a little longer than the others, and like. Like to get to you. 
Yeah. Or like they drive up, slow. To pick me up. Okay. Usually. Cool. Um, if I need them to drive faster, I literally asked an Uber driver when I was going to the airport once. I was like, can you please like step on it? Like my flight <laughs> is literally in like 30 minutes. And she's like, all right, like let me just get gas. I don't usually drive like this around with my riders, but I can do it for you. That is like actually pretty funny that you say that because <laughs> that's like a pet peeve of drivers really it's like when they're when pastors ask like can you drive faster because like they can't they're just driving the speed limit well for her she's like i'm driving slower than usual oh, okay like for me like when i like personally drive my own car like i drive a little slower with my friends than i usually do with my yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. just so they don't feel yeah, like yeah. they're gonna like oh my god they don't that. text and drive like with yeah other no, people. definitely not yeah but sometimes by yourself like yeah i mean you're not supposed to but like if you get in an accident you're only hurting yourself right but like if you're with other people then yeah anyways <laughs> don't text don't and drive, text in and drive. It's all right the law. next question is would you ever be an uber or a lyft driver you know i've actually thought about it really to make some side money yeah yeah i would i think i would go with lyft yeah um i don't know this is like so like not relevant, but I just feel like their logo is like a lot less like intimidating. Intimidating. Yeah. <laughs> um, They're like well, the the way I've heard it is that like Uber markets themselves as like the fastest mo like the fastest way to get to your destination, yeah. where Lyft markets themselves as like take a ride with your friend. Yeah. Like okay. It's a lot more friendly. Yeah. Okay. Also, it's just like company standards too, like their morals. Personally, if I'm gonna work for them, so. Oh really? Yeah. I, I take that into consideration. Why you don't? What do you mean? Um, just like I guess like their political background and like I guess oh, all the I bad don't... press they have and everything. Lyft or Uber? Uber. Yeah, yeah. So I guess that's partially why I drive with Lyft. With like their CEO or what? Um, CEO and just like I guess their company like environment. Yeah. So that's just that's just my yeah. my reasoning behind it. Okay, next question. <laughs> Get a little off topic. We're gonna there. talk forever here. <laughs> All right, next next question is, what's one thing you wish your Uber driver? Well, I'm just gonna say Uber, but like it's Uber and Lyft. Okay. What's one thing you wish your Uber or Lyft driver um, didn't do? Um. Oh wait, hold on. That's a. Helicopter. That's a helicopter. That's my Uber copter. Actually, in Brazil, they have a Uber helicopter. Yeah. Yeah. I think they have it in New York too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Maybe. But I guess. Okay, so what's one thing you wish your Uber driver didn't do? Like, if you could tell him to do one thing, to not to do one thing, what to would it be? Not text while they're driving. Do sometimes they text? Yeah, they'll like have their phone propped up on the corner, and they'll just be like texting or like oh. listening to their WhatsApp messages, and I'm like. Oh gosh. All right, this is like getting me a little uncomfortable. Like sometimes they like almost miss a turn, or like sometimes yeah. they're just like. All right, like I'm not really paying attention to the road anymore. I'm like, oh god, like I think my Uber driver almost hit somebody once. I oh like, my god. Yeah, I was like, all right, this is Yikes. not bueno. So, um, don't don't text and drive on either platform because that's yeah definitely very a dangerous. Of mine. Very dangerous, guys. Yeah. Um. Okay. So what? And then what's one thing you wish your driver did do? I, you know what? I don't know. Because a lot of them are really accommodating when I need them to be. Yeah. And like, sometimes they like know I don't want to talk and they like don't talk and they don't continue the conversation. Um, and mm -hmm. sometimes when I pick up a conversation with them, they're like really chill about it. So yeah, okay. I don't think I have any like single preference on that right now. Yeah. So, they're cool. Fun stuff. Fun stuff. All right, why don't you tell them a fun fact while I pull up the next question. Um, fun fact about me. I have literally, you know, I don't. You can't think of one thing. Okay, fun fact. I swam for 14 years and I was recruited to swim in the NCAA division. So you swam for 14 years straight, you never got out of the water? No. I'm a fish. <laughs> so I can breathe underwater. You're a fish. <laughs> Maybe I can be like the can underwater make the, Can you make the fish face? <laughs> Okay, that was a little inappropriate. Yeah, no, that was like not. <laughs> <laughs> was that past the boundaries? Yeah. <laughs> um, we don't have boundaries as no. a new brand left, so no. I mean, 
I sometimes mean, it's do. sometimes it's just like a therapy session when you get in there. It's like Yeah, honestly this guy was telling me his life like love story. He's like, Yeah, he's my Lyft driver. Like, did you like it or did you not like it? Oh my god, it was so entertaining. Okay. He was like telling me about his love life, how he was like literally buying this woman like like 70 something roses because that's how many Jeez. days they knew each other and they okay like, that's a little too much and he's like yeah we were just chasing each other around the hotel room in our robes and like drinking champagne. why is he telling you that he's just telling me his whole love story and how he's trying to win her back and everything yeah. and i was like oh my god this is literally coming like a 20 minute ride <laughs> like not even that long yeah so, i mean i guess it's kind of entertaining this guy was the coolest dude ever like it was insane all right, let's move on. Yeah. Okay. Um, that's cool, though. It is cool. Also, congrats for being recruited to the NCAA. Thanks. I didn't actually take that offer, though. Yeah, I could tell. <laughs> um, what's one thing you wish... Someone's laughing. What? What's one thing you wish you could tell your Uber driver, but, like didn't because it was awkward or like um i don't know i think sometimes it's like their car kind of smells like cigarettes so you're like clean your car out it's like i mean you would never tell you want to tell them like hey can you clean out your or car or like don't smoke in your car before you're about to drive like yeah it might have been a previous passenger though i don't think so no okay yeah but all it's right definitely weird. next question Oh, do you ever take Uber Pool? Heck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but I do not always have the most, like, I guess, frivolous funds to go out and take an Uber X by myself. Yeah, and also, it's, it's like, like twice as much. Right? You meet interesting people in a okay, pool. Okay, that's my next question. How, is Have you ever, like, met someone in Uber Pool? Yes. I have. And like you have, you've gotten like their contact information or something? Yeah, I actually really? met a recruiter from Square. No way. Like the credit card company, yeah. yeah. We actually went over, I actually went over to the office and we had like coffee and stuff. Like, And you met them in an Uber pool? Yeah. That's sick. Yeah, we literally, he was like, oh yeah, I have to drive back to a certain area because he's like, I forgot my wallet. And then we just had this whole conversation going over to San Francisco. And like the Uber driver was like totally involved in that too. That's sick. Yeah, it was really cool. Yeah. Um, cool. Um, okay. <laughs> casually just hanging out with people here. Too far. Um, <laughs> all right. We can walk and talk. We're walking and talking. All right. Um, that's pretty much it for just the questions, but. What's one thing you would like to tell? Because these are all drivers watching. Right. What's Hello. one thing you would like to tell them? Um, Look into the camera. You know, <laughs> well, you have to point the camera at me first. Yeah, I'm like, look at the camera. <laughs> um, I don't really know. I guess like all my feedback that I said, like that's Why is the shadow on your face? What is that? I don't know. Is that me? Maybe I put my sunglasses on? No, 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 you don't. It's okay. better without, but. Okay. Um, I think that's me. Oh, yeah, that's that my is, head. It's your head? Here, get closer. <laughs> okay. Um, wow, it's really bright. Okay. Um, I guess the only feedback I would have is, like, kind of put yourself in, your sh like, the shoes of the writer. And yeah. Just kind of, like, I guess kind of think of that experience and, like, what you would expect out of that experience. Yeah. Because um, I think sometimes drivers just kind of don't think about that because I guess they're in the car all day and they're used to it. Mm -hmm. um, but I guess that's, like, one important thing because sometimes writers are, like, really, really, like... I guess picky in particular about how like drivers like do their thing for me I'm like whatever about it but there's like obviously like texting and driving and like yeah. you know paying attention to the phone instead of the road mm -hmm. kind of bo it bothers me a lot yeah um, and just like stepping into the car and it smells like cigarettes and I'm like yikes mm -hmm. so that's just my pet peeves but, a lot yeah. of pet peeves yeah but otherwise <laughs> great otherwise rides. you like Uber and Lyft in general yeah. yeah as long as I don't like almost die then you know, it's a good ride. Alright, so if you guys like Fiona, <laughs> give this video a thumbs up. And if you want to see her, come back. Yay! Thumbs up, I promise. And you be. have something to plug as well, right? Yeah, so I'm actually not just a blogger, I'm also on YouTube as well. Oh um, my gosh, spoiler alert. <laughs> 
but I am not an uber lift kind of like specialist I'm more of like a lifestyle and fashion person uh, so if you're interested in that definitely slide over to my channel um, I'll have it linked here sorry somebody's walking over here casually <laughs> okay fashion review how is my fashion today Wait, we gotta, we gotta show your outfit though. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Jeans, nice shoes. Are those Allbirds? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> all right, white, white crew neck, glasses, very hip, very appropriate for the Bay Area. So I, I like, what do you rate my fashion today? It's, it's nice, pretty it's casual. A nice casual. It's like casual. Yeah. It's a nice casual. I, I give it a, I give it a, a solid six point five. I was gonna say seven, but. Or I say 6.5. <laughs> That's just me. I'm really picky, especially when it comes to men's fashion. Actually, like I mean, women's. What, what would I? What could I add to this to make it more fashionable? I was thinking like, like a, a jacket, watch? like a cool jacket, maybe like a watch. It's it's hard to wear a jacket with this because it's so thick, though. Well, I was thinking like maybe like kind of like a big like maybe like I mean obviously it's a little sunny out today, so it's a little warmer. But like mm. if you put on like a nice like coat, like a pea coat kind of thing. Okay. You know that sure. would look pretty cool, or like. Boots. All right, let's review your fashion. My fashion. Oh boy. All right. We got the uh, Sperry's. We got Sperry's today. I feel like this is a very nautical kind of outfit that I'm going. Yeah, with it's today. good. I like it. You uh, got the purse there. Yeah, from Madewell, my favorite. Oh, I went to Madewell the other day. Really? Yeah, yeah. I shop there all the time. Um, but yeah, pretty casual pretty sweater. Pretty simple, casual. It's pinstripes. Keep it comfy. That's kind of my motto. Keep yeah. it comfy? Yeah. Keep okay, it comfy. cool. All right, guys. Make sure to check her out on Instagram. I'll see you all next time. All right. Yes. Like, go subscribe. Hop my Ubercopter. <laughs> all right, yeah. We're going we're to go take an Uber. All right, bye, guys. Bye.